Good morning, everyone. Uh, I continue my talk. In the first video, I uh, mentioned about protein-protein reduction, and here I will uh, explain a little bit protein-protein reduction again. In here, you can see that we saw the network of protein-protein reduction, right? Uh, this is the gene I input uh, around 67 genes related to the curcumin and obesity. And in here, um, after I run this uh, gene and I found out uh, the set of this gene, they link to the respond to nuclear um, nutrient levels, respond to the extracellular stimuli and adipogenesis. Uh, they also calculate the log 10p. Log 10p, it means that the p value, they log uh, um, logarithm logarithms and with the most minus uh, high highest minus one it means that low uh, p value in here that, that uh, they said that three of uh, uh, protein protein network uh, related to uh, the pathway it means that they confirm for the pathway at the minus before here it means that three of them play multiple roles in the pathology of obesity um, related by uh, curcumin and the uh, most important one, they can, they can, they can, they can calculate for you the MCOD. Um, MCOD representative for the molecular complex uh, detection. If the network uh, have contain around three or five hundred protein, and they will use this algorithm to identify the uh, condensed uh, connected network component. So after that, they will show you. The result like that in here, you know, uh, you can see here the red one here. They will uh, make condensed one, and they uh, they will show you another uh, net network. And the green one, the blue one here, they make the condensed one with another uh, um, another node here to make the another network similar with the um, uh, the uh, the green one. And uh, you can see here. Uh, this uh, MCOD, this very strong um, potent one, they also so that you know respond to the hormone, respond to nuclear levels, and respond to extracellular stimuli, play important roles in the obesity development and, uh, and reduced by the curcumin. It means that if you took the right uh, curcumin and they can um, reduce the uh, obesity development by uh, regulate this uh, pathway, for example, respond to the hormone, maybe uh, respond to the nu uh, nutrient levels and respond to extracellular stimuli. Uh, similar with another um, pathway here. Uh, if you want uh, to understand more here, I explain detail in my paper here. I will put my uh, the the links um, of my paper in the uh, the, the end of the video. So next, uh, they will show you the how they qualify uh, quality control and association analysis. Uh, in here they said that the term with p value less than over one and uh, min minimum of three and enrichment of one and they run uh, this gene in different uh, catalogy for example COVID, Deltoy, Signature, uh, GNS, uh, pathogen, some crap like that. And in here they show you the summarized enrichment of analysis in the COVID database for example and they soon go in here, but I think here uh, uh, they did not uh, relate really to uh, our um, um, to my purpose, so I did not explain here. But uh, in here, um, uh, I will explain a little bit about cell tri signature. It means that when the uh, when the people they when the people they take um, curcumin and curcumin will target in the hypo um, hypo uh, hypo side. It means that the cell in the liver. And the the, the the tree of you know cell have the highest uh the lowest um uh, p value, and the next one they will focus on the uh, monocyte or um narrow uh, more narrow marrows monocyte linked to the immune system and more narrow uh some kind of thing like that. The next one they will show you the uh um well which kind of disease uh the gene here related uh to in here you know. Uh, the 67 gene that I mentioned before, they will uh, target in the fatty liver disease. Oh, very important, right? They link to the obesity. They also related to the hyperlipidemia, and they have they also link to the hyperinsulinism, and also they also link to the endothelium dysfunction, diabetes, um, 
millimeters all of them related to the uh, obesity it means that the curcumin they will uh, protect uh, people against obesity by regulating a lot of disease like that uh, the next one they uh, they will show you uh, uh, which cell they will target all right the previous one they uh, they will target on the organs and here they will uh, show you the which which cell specific cell in here they will target on the antipocyte it means related to the obesity right and here also they will target on the liver cell um a lung smooth muscle cardiac and blood but the more important one they focus on the, the adipocytes uh, the next one they will show you they uh, with the um, the transcription factor regulated by disease in here they said that the sp1 or uh, rela here is nkb uh, or john or task three here they regulated disease uh, because you know um, from the transcription or translation right uh, the transcription factor play mountain rules in the process uh, to make the transcription and translation so here they also show you how to how the gene how the transcription factor regulated the gene and the next one they will show you uh, the the another one is the transcription factor target and here they also show you another table it that means that the task 5 or pa x2 or uh, x gene f uh, 540 seven target gene here related they can regulate the 70 gene as i mentioned before and in here uh, uh, this is the, uh, the preference uh, how they analyze uh, and how they, how they run and they can show the result of that if you have any interest you can read the whole paper here and you can understand more but in here uh, i um, i also uh, mentioned how the gene uh, you know and here i also show the result with the uh, the pathway, uh, pathway related to the curcumin and obesity, as I mentioned before, right in here, uh, for example here, uh, and also in here I also show the protein protein interaction between curcumin and obesity. Uh, if you have interest and in, uh, and here I also show the uh, let me see, uh, I did not show the anyway. Um, if if you have interest uh, in our paper, you can read our paper and you can understand more. Um, so anyway, today I use um, today I show you uh, how to use the method caps to analyze the bio biological process, a uh, pathway, and protein protein interaction, um, as well as uh, transcription factor. I hope this video will help you for further uh, study. Thank you for.